Hari. Welcome to this ABCDE series in which we are going to solve the CAT questions of previous years. So here before you is a question from CAT 2018 slot 1, the quant section. So this is a question based on logarithm and there were three questions based on logarithm in slot 1 of CAT 18. So I will highly recommend you to pause your video or take a screenshot and then solve this question on your own. After that, we'll move to the solution part. Okay, so uh, as I told you earlier, there were three questions based on log uh, in CAT 2018 slot 1. So this question says, if x is a positive quantity such that 2 power x is 3 raised to power log of uh, 2 to the base 5, then x is equal to, we have four options. And I have also written for your quick reference the uh, basic properties of the logarithm here. Okay, so if I take log on both sides of this expression, so I'm going to get this x log 2, which will be equal to log of 2 to the base 5, this power will come before this times log of 3. Now the log which I have taken, I can use any base here. So to make our calculation simpler, because I need to find the value of x, so I should put the base 2 here. So if I take base 2, so base 2 here also, so this log 2 to the base 2, it is equal to 1 because uh, we have mentioned it here. Log of m to the base n means log m upon log n, so this is 1. So from here I get this x is equal to, similarly this is log 2 upon log 5 and this one is log 3 upon log 2. So this log 2 will be cancelled and I will be left with log 3 to the base uh, to, uh, upon log 5 which can be written as log of 3 to the base 5. So that is our final answer. But if I check the options, in the options this first option does not match because uh, base 5 is right but uh, this is 3 which is 8, 8, 8 so this is not correct. And let's say the second option, in the second option I have 1 plus uh, again log base 5 is right but it is 3 by 5 and this one is extra. So what to do about this? Let's check. This 3 by 5, I have seen it here, log m upon n is log m minus log n. So I can write this as 1 plus, this is log of 3 to the base 5 minus log of 5 to the base 5. I'm using this property only, this log of m minus log n is equal to log m by n. So this log m to the base, uh, this log 5 to the base 5, it is 1. And so this 1 will be cancelled with this one because this is positive sign, this is of negative sign. And so this is my answer, which is right. That's the right answer. And because there is not an option that none of these are kind of be determined, so answer is going to be one of these four options. So there's no need to check the further two options. So surely we can say this option 2 is the right answer. So here's another question of CAT 2018 slot 1 based on log. So as I told you earlier, there are three questions. Uh, there were three questions in this slot and this is another question based on log. So again, take some time and solve this question on your own. Right. Now, uh, this question says log of 81 to the base 12 is equal to P. Then we have to find the value of this expression. So no need to panic that uh, I don't need to substitute this value of p at every place and then see what to do, what to do. Uh, let's do what can we do with this. So this is log of 81 to the base 12 is equal to p. And I want to find the value of 4 minus p upon 4 plus p. By seeing this expression, I'm reminded about uh, an expression which you have seen in your schools, which was componendo and dividendo. So if I get to know somehow 4 upon p or p by 4, then I can get this expression easily. So let's try to find it out here. This 81 I know it is 3 raised to power 4. So this can be written as uh, log of 3 raised to power 4 to the base 12, which means 4 times log of 3 to the base 12, which means 4 times log of 3 upon log of 12. Right? This is the left hand side part of this expression and this is given equal to p. Okay, I got it. As I wanted, I wanted the expression like 4 by p. So, yeah, 4 by p is ban gaya hai. So, if I rewrite this uh, as 4 by p is equal to how much? It will be equal to log of 12 upon log of 3. Is it right? 
So log 4 by p is log 12 by log 3. Now, because I want to know the value of 4 minus p upon 4 plus p, so from this numerator, I need to subtract that denominator and then uh, I will add this denominator to the numerator to get the final expression. So it will look like 4 minus p upon 4 plus p. Whatever I am doing in the left hand side, I need to do it right hand side also. So it becomes log 12 minus log 3 upon log of 12 plus log of 3, right? Now, I know that log 12 minus log 3 means what? It is log of 12 by 3, which means log of 4. Similarly, log of 12 plus log 3 means log 12 into 3. That is log of 36. Log of 36. Right. Now, this 36 means uh, it is 6 square and this 4 is 2 square. So, I can write it as 2 log 2 upon 2 log 6. Or simply log 2 by log 6 because this 2 will be cancelled. But wait, I want to find the value of this expression multiplied with 3. So I need to multiply 3 also here. So this becomes 3 times 4 minus p upon 4 plus p is equal to 3 times log 2 upon log 6. So that should be my answer. Let's check my options. So my option have base 6 in two options and 2 and 4. 2 and 4 is not possible. So this uh, base, this 6 will come at the base for sure. And now this 3 is nowhere. So 3 I need to take inside. So it will become 2 cube. So this expression can be rewritten like this. Log to the base 6 of what number? 2 power 3. That means log of 8 to the base 6. So that is our answer which means option 1. Welcome back. So in this series and we are presenting here another question based on log that came in CAT 2018 slot 1. So here is the question for you and again pause the video and solve it on your own first. Okay, now let's see. So this question is asking about uh, this log of something is equal to 3 and log of another expression is equal to 3 and uh, uh, we are having some variables a and b here and we want to find the value of a plus b and these are the options. So what to do? So we have already written the basic properties of log here which we can use in these questions. So for this question to find the value of a, I can use this last property. If log of m to the base n is equal to k, then it means, it means that this m is equal to n raised to power k. Similarly, in this expression, I can write that this bracketed part 5 plus log of a to the base 3, it should be equal to 2 raised to power 3, right, which means 8. So log of a to the base 3 will become 8 minus 5, that is 3, and this a will be equal to 3 raised to power 3, that is 27, it is simple, right. But wait, I need to find the value of b also. So let's use the second expression. So going by similar lines, I can say this bracketed expression, that is 4a, a, I can substitute this value now, 4 times 27, plus 12, plus that is log of b to the base 2, that is equal to, that should be equal to now, it is 5 raised to power 3. So 5 raised to power 3 is how much? It is 125, right? Now this 4 times 27 is 108, 108 plus 12, that is 120. So this part is 120. So if I subtract uh, it from this side, I will get to, uh, this value log of b to the base 2 that comes out to be 125 minus 120 that is 5 which means this b is equal to 2 raised to power 5 right it is the same thing uh, we are doing the, using the same property again and again repeatedly so this 2 power 5 is 32 so that is the value of b so our question was asking about the value of a plus b so i have both the values it is 27 and 32 so 27 plus 32 that comes out to be 59 which means option 3 is the right answer. Thank you.